fact history for you. On this day in 1903, the first teddy bear was sold. That's right. And now, 114 years later, it's still one of the most popular toys in the world. Erica Walker takes a look back at teddy bear's Brooklyn roots and its connection to an iconic president. This shop at 404 Tompkins Avenue in bed Brooklyn, is home to one of the world's cuddliest toys. 114 years ago, after just one day on display in this very storefront window, the first teddy bear was sold. The teddy bear reigns supreme uh, as a plush toy for children. The iconic bear is known for its soft exterior and lovable nature. But Theodore Roosevelt reprisor Joe Wiegand knows all too well it wouldn't be the toys we know it if it weren't for a failed hunting trip by our 26th president. He refused to shoot a bear that had been wounded and tied to a tree in the delta of the Mississippi uh, River region of, of Onward, Mississippi. And uh, that story spread. After pardoning the bear, the Washington Post printed this illustration of the event, the cartoon highlighting the softer side of the huntsman. Rose and Morris McDum of Brooklyn saw the cartoon and began designing a commemorative toy right away. He was also, I think, then uh, encapsulated as this uh, uh, great character in this toy so that uh, children probably uh, were encouraged to have a great imagination with regards to how they might play with their teddy, boy, the teddy bear. The next year, the McDum's velvet bear with shoe button eyes was ready to go. But first, the couple reached out to Roosevelt himself for permission to use his name. It's uh, said that Roosevelt wrote back and said to me, go ahead and do so, but I don't think it will help your sales very much at all. The success of the teddy bear was so great, the McDums were able to start the Ideal Toy Company, which went on to create some of the baby boomer generation's most prized toys, including the Betsy Wetsy and the Magic 8 Ball. And as for that original teddy bear, it can be found on display at the Smithsonian. Reporting from the Upper East Side, Erica Walker, Fox 5 News. And that original teddy bear was made of velvet. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, that's a luxurious one, right? Oh, great I still have my teddy bear. It's in my mom's house. <laughs> All right, it's a sign.